Hey, Scorpio. This is going to be your prelude to the nitty gritty for from now until November 30th, okay? This is a prelude. Let's see what's going on for Scorpios. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Scorpios. What's going on with you guys? If this reading doesn't resonate for you, I prompt you to go ahead and check your Moon and Rising sign. If this is your Sun sign here. Scorpio. Look at that. The High Priest is jumping out. You guys are very, very intuitive. That is a given. Scorpio. What's going on for my Scorpios? See the Lover's card here. Hmm. Okay. Let's see, guys. What's going on? Ooh. What's keeping you up? Huh. Is that Emperor keeping you up? We have Gemini energy here, Aries, Pisces energy currently. And I feel like what is actually bothering you is a fact that this Emperor is not making a move. It's not making a move and it's got you in this like stagnant um, position where you're just like you're almost just waiting on them to um, decide what it is that they're going to do. I feel like, you know, you're having maybe not nightmares, but I feel like you've been dreaming about this person. I feel like you're thinking about the happy times that you guys shared. But then there's also those moments where you feel like, you know, they didn't give as much as you did. You know, even though the situation itself was overall like a happy situation for you. I mean, you enjoyed overall being with this person. Um, but I feel like, you know, they was they were just giving you like, you know, I don't want to say scraps, but like not as much as you were giving because I feel like you were really, really giving here and you were almost almost begging for attention. And I think that, you know, you walk away, but it's not something that that you feel fantastic about doing. We have Taurus energy here, um, Aquarius. This is something that really, really took you, uh, you know, it took a lot out of you to be able to, to remove yourself from the situation. I feel like you're, you have been enlightened. I feel like you are self-aware. And so now that you know, you gave so much to this relationship in the past that you are keeping a lot to yourself. Like you, you don't have anything else to give at this point. You're holding things back. You're holding yourself back. And they're also being very, very stubborn. At this point, you really don't know which way to go. You don't know which way to go. Um, we have Libra energy, Leo. I mean, all just about all the elements are here. But what I see here is something that you felt like was very lucrative and solid in the past. It ended. And it ended because somebody was not willing to put in as much work as the other person okay they were holding a lot of things back being very selfish okay and that brought you to a point where you felt like there is no no other place for me to go but within myself because i can't keep giving and giving and giving and not receiving anything from this person And I feel like even though 
you know, you didn't want to leave, you are still there. You're still there trying to decide if this was the right thing for you to do, was to walk away. And you're really hung up on this decision here. Still very reflective and thinking about it. Okay? So I'm going to go ahead and clarify and pull on, pull on the rest of of the energy for the other person that you're dealing with in the nitty gritty. If you guys are interested and this resonates for you, then uh, come join me over there, okay? See you there.